Lydia is a fascinating woman on several levels. On the practical level, she succeeded in business in a world that was dominated by men. She had a business in purple. Purple was a very expensive business to run, and there were two varieties of purple. One was by, made by snail, from snails and exceedingly expensive. And then there was this fake purple that I described Lydia as creating. The point being that she succeeded in a world where few women did. So immediately on that level, as a woman who has to work every day, I had to ask the question, what made Lydia such a success? What kind of person would have succeeded when there was so much against her? Then on the level of faith, Lydia was the first convert in Europe. And Europe became eventually exceedingly important in the spread of Christian church, the Christian faith and the establishing of God's church. Why would God choose this woman as the first convert? Not only that, but she opened her home to Paul and the friends that were traveling with him. This meant that her home literally became the first church in Europe. Lydia, in some ways, was intrepid. When Paul and Silas ended up in jail, essentially their, their reputation was ruined in Philippi. And as a merchant, Lydia should have tried to avoid them. And yet instead she insisted when they were released from jail, she insisted that they stay at her home. And as she insisted that they stay at her home from the beginning, even though she had just met them. But her new faith made her heart thirsty for more. And after that, when they returned from jail, she opened her home to them again and uh, received them openly. So an, a fascinating woman.